Blood cells develop in the bone marrow from blood stem cells in a process called hematopoiesis. Disruptions in this process lead to acute lymphoblastic leukemia, which is the most common cancer in children. For example, a genetic alteration resulting in ETV6 rung one fusion gene can impact the differentiation. Once these cells acquire additional cancer-driving gene mutations, they develop leukemia. 25% of ALL patients have the ETV6 rung one fusion in their leukemia cells, and about 10% of all patients with ALL relapse. Even though ETV6 rung one positive leukemia has generally good prognosis, two out of 10 relapsed patients represent this subtype due to the high frequency of ETV6 rung one leukemia in children. This highlights the urgent need for new ways to improve therapy and prevent relapse in this leukemia type. We collected a cohort of ETV6 rung one leukemia samples, which were divided into three groups based on their response to early induction chemotherapy, and compared the differences in gene alterations between the responder groups. As an example, we identified two genes that were found significantly associated with therapy response. When they were deleted from the leukemia cells, the patients responded better to given therapy. We are currently validating the findings in additional patient cohorts and cell culture assays. In future, these findings could be utilized to improve patient risk stratification and to find better therapies to kill leukemia cells.